This is KLFY News 10 at 6. We begin today in Gaynor, where authorities are looking for the person responsible for vandalizing and stealing an ATM inside a grocery store. It turns out that grocery store is a family-owned business of the chief of police. News 10's Rodrika Taylor is at Lugon's shopping center as cleanup began. It is shocking to hear the police chief's family-owned business was the target of an ATM burglary. The cleanup has started to repair what was damaged. Workers measured and cut the wood to replace the double doors no longer at Loyon's shopping center. According to authorities, early Wednesday morning, deputies were called out to the store in reference to someone crashing into it and stealing the ATM machine. These are photos of the damage left behind. Upon arrival, um, our deputies notified that they also had a damaged Dodge pickup truck that was observed in a field off of Elliott Road. Whenever our deputies get there, they locate the vehicle and the ATM was observed in the bed of the truck. Along with the ATM machine, they had building materials from the store. Inside the store, you can still see tire marks left from the vehicle. Lieutenant Regina Swear with the Vermilion Parish Sheriff's Office says the Dodge pickup truck was stolen. Gaydon Police of Chief Crew Delcom says Loyon's Shopping Center is family owned and has been operating since the 1950s. Even with the recent burglary, customers were still able to purchase the groceries they needed while the damage was being repaired. It's just, we do find it's odd that it, it just so happened it is the police chief. You know, it's his store. But we're, we're hoping to find out something soon. The Vermilion Parish Sheriff's Office is investigating. If you have information, contact their office or Crime Stoppers at 337-740-TIPS. In Gaydon, Rodrika Taylor, KLFY News 10.